Hello dear students, welcome to Devika's Commerce and Management Academy. So today we will see quartiles, deciles, percentiles in continuous series. Okay? So individual and discrete series, same formula, one formula. What was that if it is a quartile 1, Q1, size of n plus 1 by 2th item, same formula for individual and discrete series. In the same way, percentile deciles also. But continuous series will have two formulas. If it is a median, size of n by 2th item, not n plus 1, okay? And second formula is also there. What was the second formula? L plus n by 2 minus C f by f into i. That was the median formula. The same thing we are going to apply for quartiles, deciles, percentiles also. Through a problem, you will have a clarity. Now, what is the problem given to us? Calculate upper and lower quartiles means Q1, Q3. Upper quartile means Q3. Lower quartile means Q1. And D2, uh, D2, P90 and PS. Deciles 2, percentile 90, percentile 5. So, these we have to calculate in continuous series. What is given to us marks? Below 10, below 10 means 0 to 10. 10 to 20, 20 to 40, 40 to 60, 60 to 80, above 80. Class intervals are not in order, but does not matter. You can keep it as it is. And frequency is given to us. Step number 1 is that you have to prepare the cumulative frequency, whether it is a discrete or continuous series, right? So, we will first go for cumulative frequency. 8, 8 plus 10, 18, 18 plus 20 to 40, 40 plus 25, 65, 65 plus 5, 10, 75 and if you add 5, it is 80. Means n is, n is 80. This total is 80. We have two formulas. First of all, we will go for upper quartile, lower quartile. Both are there, no? Q1, Q3. First, we will take Q1. So, Q1. First formula is size of n by fourth item. Size of n by fourth item, no plus 1, okay? n by fourth item. So, the, here n is for 80, 80 by 4 means 20th, 20th item. Where does this 20th item lies in CF you have to see. 20th item it lies here. You can mark a line with pencil. It will be easy for you to identify. Okay. Now we will go for the second formula. What is the second formula? Q1 is equal to L plus N by 4 minus CF by frequency into I. Earlier for median also same thing we have done but N by 2 we have, we have taken. Now here n by 4 because the formula, first formula is n by 4. In median it was n by 2. Quartile 1 means n by 4. Okay? So according to this, this L is here 20 lower class interval. n by 4, n by 4 already we have done 20 minus Cf. Cf is here this one above cumulative frequency that is 18. Frequency, frequency is here 22 into i class interval of this 20 to 40 class interval is here difference is 20 into 20 just we will do the calculations 20 plus here is 2 2, 2 into 20 comes to 400 400 divided by 22 400 divided by 22 it comes to uh, 18. Now, let me do the calculation here. 2 na? 2 into 20 comes to 2 into 20 is here 40. So, by mistake I have written 400. So, 40 divided by 22. It comes to 1.81. 818 means 1.82 we could say. 20 plus uh, 1.82. It comes to 21.82. 21.82 is the answer Q1. In the same way, we will go for Q2, Q3. Q3 
two will be median only. So what's the formula? First one size of three into n by fourth item. Earlier it was the individual discursive is three into n plus one by four. Now here three into n by fourth item. So three into n by four. N by four is uh, n is here eighty. 3 into 80 by 4 comes to 60. This is 60th item. Where does it lie? 60th item. You can write one sentence. There I forgot to write. You can write one sentence, sentence here only. 20th item lies in CF 40. It means 20 to 40. Okay. Uh, 60th item lies in class uh, 60 means here okay 40 to 60 40 to 60 okay now what is the formula same formula q3 is equal to l plus 3n by 4 minus cf by frequency into i if you apply this formula L is here 40. This one is over now. So, do not get confused. So, here L is 40 lower class interval plus 3 n by 4 already we have done 3 n by 4 is 60. 60 minus CF. CF is here 40. 40 by frequency. Frequency is 25. into i, i class interval is 20. If you do the ca calculations, uh, 60 minus 40 is 20, 20 into 20, 400, 400 divided by 25 comes to 16, 40 plus uh, 16 comes to 56, 56 is the Q3 answer, right? Next. Uh, Lower class central Q1, Q3 is over. Now, next we will see D2. So, here third one. From here only I will start. Uh, D2. D2 is equal to size of uh, n by 4. No? So, 2n by 10th, 10th item. How do you got this? 2 into n divided by 10. 2 n by 10. Yeah, 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 10 means here deciles. Okay. So, 2 into n comes to n is here 80. 2 into 80 by 10. 160. 160 by 10 means 16. Okay. 16th item lies in class interval here. This one is over now. So, do not get confused. This is over. Now, we will focus here. 16 lies in class interval in class of 4, 10 to 20. 10 to 20. Now, we will go for the next formula. So, that is D2 is equal to L plus uh, 2n by 10 minus Cf by frequency into i. L is here 10, 10 plus 2n by 10 already we have done that is 16, 16 minus CF, CF is here 8 by frequency, frequency is 10 into I, class interval is here 10, earlier it was 20, now here it is 10, if you do the calculations 16 minus 8 means 8. 8 means 800, 800 divided by 10 is 80, 10 plus uh, 20 is here, D2 no, 16 minus 8 is 8, 8, 8, 8, 8 into 10, it is 80, 80 divided by 10 means, uh, it is 8 only, so 8 means 10 plus 8 is equal to 18, 18 is the D2, 
are you are you understanding it calculations okay next after that p 90 fourth one p 90 p 90 is equal to size of 90 into n by 100th item 90 into n by 100th item percentile na so 100 i have written so if you do the calculation 90 into n is here 80 80 by 100 comes to 72 where does it lies 72 72 lies here Here it comes. So, we will write the formula P90 is equal to L plus uh, 90 N by 100 minus CF by frequency into I. L plus. Now, the formula as per the formula lower class interval is 60. 60 plus 90 n by 100 means already we have done that is 72. 72 minus CF. CF is here 65. Frequency is 10. Class interval is it is 20 into 20. So, if you do the calculation you can write here one sentence also 70 li 72 lies in class interval. 72 lies in class 60 to 80. You can write one sentence also after that write the formula. So, now here 72 minus 65 comes to 7 na? 72 into 20 20 divided by 10 it comes to 14 60 plus 14. This is 74. 74 is P90. Am I clear? Next P, yes. P5, sorry. This is P5. P5 answer is 5. This is homework. You have to do it. Shall I explain? For P5, first formula is here. P5 is equal to size of uh, P5 means phi n by 100th item. So, this is the first formula. Second formula is you know, second formula is e, P phi is equal to L plus phi n by 100 minus C f by frequency into I. Second formula, I need not to explain if you understood this, you please work out your answer must be 5. How many of you are getting? Let me know in the comment box. Taking lots of time and energy for the statistics subject because it's depth. I am not leaving even a single item also. So, it's taking time. Anyway, I want you to be perfect. If possible, this problem also you understand and work out by yourself. Let me know if you are understanding and if you are getting the same answers in the comment box. It's a matter of one minute. Write it in the comment box. I'll be very happy to read your comments. Next class, we'll take another interesting topic. Till that period, keep practicing. Don't forget to share these videos. Okay? So, study well. Bright future. Have a bright future. Good luck.